So Saturday, I was going to go take the amateur extra exam, which I'm happy to say I passed. But on the way there, I came out and got in the truck, shut the door, and the rear window shattered, just exploded. I don't know if it's going to show up in this video or not, but those are gazillions of little cracks all the way across. A lot of the glass blew out in the bed of the truck. So, since it started raining yesterday after I got home from the exam, and all night and part of this morning, I just put a piece of uh, opaque painter's plastic drop cloth on there and duct taped the crap out of it. The guy's not going to be able to get out here till Tuesday or Wednesday to fix it, although the insurance is going to cover it. So, anyways. But yesterday afternoon, I mean, it exploded glass all the way down out into here. Little little BB type pieces. Anyways, that's the deal with the truck. I know I, I didn't. I never heard of that. Never had it happen. And then I go out on the forums, and apparently it happens. <laughs> Nobody knows why. You know, rain. Uh, not rain, but heat. Uh, maybe a bird flew into it. Who knows? Uh, but that sure doesn't just give you a crack when it goes. The whole thing goes from one side to the other. The only part that didn't break is the very middle where the sliding part goes. That's still in one piece, although the rest of the window was bowed out and there was a big gap in there. So anyways, try and get that fixed Tuesday or Wednesday. Ruby's very first motel room. I can't, I can't walk, she's staying with, literally within inches of my feet. <laughs> I already got her water out, I'll feed her later. It's not a bad little room, it has a microwave, refrigerator, TV set, king size bed. Standard motel room junk. So, anyways, I'm gonna go find some cokes. I'll leave her in here to fret some. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> pat, 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 pat. Say hello. Say hello to the YouTube. <laughs> Well, she heard the camera start up <laughs> after several hours in here she finally calmed down and ate her dinner then she wanted up on the bed <laughs> she wanted up there <laughs> are you comfortable dog <laughs> took her three hours to eat her dinner that's unheard of this is Ruby's very first night in a motel anyways Got a boring, <laughs> got a boring basic cable. Not even any got. Don't even have any HBO. But she does not want to be away from me. That's for sure. As soon as she heard noise, she was up and ready to get off the bed. Okay, we're done. Duke's Automotive. With my trusty travel companion. And we went down there and promptly took a dump right in the middle. <laughs> Anyways, they deal in travel light RVs. Found them on uh, RV Trader. Although the stuff on the website is an error in terms of the weight. Because I was looking at two campers within 20 pounds of each other. And as it turns out, there are several hundred pounds difference. So we're going to get one of these. This is a uh, FB and I'm going to get the FK which is down on the other end. They're getting ready to put it on the truck. We'll do the paperwork and pay for it. That's kind of what I was going to build but this already has all this junk on it. The only thing I'll have to do extra to it is uh, replace that vent up on top with a Max Air fan. Okay. It's hot out here, and we're got to do paperwork. So talk to you later. Bye. 
installing the Brophy tie down system. We want to get. We got a fair number of RVs in here. Mostly travelite, some Palominos. I thought they only had one of the razors left in stock, but they got one of just about every floor plan. Not hard to find two. Duke's Automotive, Lancaster, South Carolina. Sell some of them 4x4s too. You know, down here and look at our FK. There's our FK sitting way up in there so they can load it on the truck. Outside shower, 20 pound propane. Noisy here right on this road, it's a busy road. It ain't real big on the inside, but it's got a full kitchen over there. I'll do more video later. Battery. It's, uh, there's a porta potty in there, so I'll swap it out with mine. 5,000 BTU, and I'll swap out that vent with a max air fan somewhere up there. There's got to be 12 volts I can hook into. And, uh, a little two cubic foot refrigerator. Okay, 30 amp power cord. Hooks in there. Hooks in there. Got a couple of outlets back here. Cable TV thing. I guess I'll get a TV eventually. What this sucker is up in the air. <laughs> A lot of brass lines there. It's got a city water fill. It's got a hot water heater, so uh, the medic hot water heater, so you can come out here and put up a shower tent, and take hot and cold showers. Aluminum siding. Oh well, there's a whole bunch more off down through there. Anyways. Film until it's loaded on truck. Oh, there it is. I store bought one instead of me building one. It's the Razor FK. I'll do more detail. Sticks out a little bit in the back, but not as much as I thought it would. Lights are all working. And we're ready to go.